Hello guys, it's me Toffee Dog, and we are doing an opening video and I just realised it would probably be a good idea to do it on the floor. Now, I did say on my social pages that I was going to do one of this here, which I still have the box for, but unfortunately I was a bit emotional to film it. But that's a story I can probably do for a whole other video, which is funny but upsetting. So that's up in my room, so I do have it. If you follow me on Twitter, you'll know. But yesterday I ordered something because I picked up the latest Shrike catalogue and saw this and thought, how did I not know about this? I, I keep updated about Shrike every day I visit. So either they did a really good job hiding their new products for the second half of this year, or I'm just really bad at researching. So I've had to turn it round, or I might have to, but I shall block it out in the editing because I don't want to you guys to see where I live. I know, I've, I've got 30 subscribers. I doubt one of them's going to go come and try and visit me at my house, but you... You never know. You you don't release personal details like that. There might be some people who hate me even and want to burn my house down. But that's the extreme example. So, we should be good. Yes, we are good. And this looks fairly well packaged. I don't think we're going to get in a box, it looks like. Fancy box like that. If you focus, camera. Camera, you're not focusing. So it looks like we're just going to be getting it. Oh, I see. Now I'm not normally a girly girl, but uh, oh gosh. this is what happens when I can buy my own things with my own money. I oh my gosh, this is even more awesome in person. I'm just I'm just going to place this down. So as you can see, it is the. <laughs> Horse um, mermaid, as I call it. I know it has a full name, and it is beautiful. Oh my gosh! And the horse. Oh, I love the horse. Ah! <laughs> so I'm gonna try and open this. It does have those tricky things, but we we, we shall solve this. We shall messily cut. I just got back from work, so. This is a good thing to come back to. My parents are out, which is even better. Oh my gosh, you are beautiful. Look at that horse face. And, uh, look at her face. I think she's beautiful, she is. I did have a bit of, not problem, but I do have a bit of an issue with one of the models I currently have. I got a cow balm recently as a well done. For my A level results, I finished them. So, my mum paid half of the Shite Cow Barn, the, min uh, the small one. But I will say the person that comes with it is not painted to the highest quality. Now, I don't know if it's the actual paint itself or whether it's the plastic because I noticed the humans, the plastic they're made out of has changed. And I think I'm just going to put this here. No, this is a messy opening video, it's not planned, but hey, what on my channel, what is on my channel planned? Nothing, nothing, that's what you get from my channel, non-planned videos. So, I'm going to continue talking about it while I get this out of its main box and then I'll take the phone back, but the paint has already started to come off now luckily they've done an undercoat of skin tone paint underneath so now it just looks like he's got awkwardly ripped jeans on the back but i just i just don't get it i suppose i'm used to such high standards but i will show you that <laughs> later as you can see i managed to get the box <laughs> the box unconstructed but we should be able to cut through this plastic oh i don't want to don't don't damage the horse come on scissors you're good you're a good quality scissor i will recommend you to the viewers if you just do this let's see if we can get this from an uh, angle where i don't have to hold the camera or not because this is so much fun right now i just want the horse i don't care 
don't effing care about anything else. So, it looks like I will be talking about it then. Yes! Victory. So, anyway, as I was saying, because that is so important right now, oh, I think I'm going to have to bite the dust on this one and go def down the old-fashioned way. Yeah, anyway, so I'm a little bit confused. I hope it's a once in a set um boo boo as i call it because Schleich make their models to a really high quality and occasionally they do have their weaker times i've had models which i've had been as impressed with but i've never had paint problems paint peeling off within the first few days of me getting it or I've never had a problem with the humans at all. And I love the opposable arms. I adore them. I have no problem with the bigger humans. Even though, ironically, they've made the dog smaller to fit in with the previous ones. So I don't know if they're going to try and put the dogs back up to size. But, and also, this is surprisingly easy compared to others. Um, So we'll just have to see. I... I do like the opposable arms. It's stupidly when I got that cow pun, I didn't notice the man had opposable arms. So I literally came down the stairs screaming with happiness. Mum was very confused. She thought I had just maybe finished building the cow barn. I went, Mum, Mum, they've got opposable arms. Oh my gosh, I've got opposable arms. This is the best day of my life. But anyway... I've managed to free, 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 free. So this is another one I'm considering. And even as far as to say to get this carriage, I don't like carriages, but Schleich have made theirs so beautiful and well done that I am now tempted to go full out and get the carriage. Horse, you shall be free. You shall be free very soon. And also, actually, no, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm not going to put this in the editing. This is... I don't think I'm going to try to edit. I'm lazy. No. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dearie, dearie me. Oh dearie, 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 dearie. Dearie, dearie me. Try to do our unboxing video is harder than you think. This would be easier with my camera, which is now fixed. And my laptop is now fixed, finally. It was just a charger. But I find it so much easier on the phone. Will you just stand up phone? I think I'm just going to have to go. Oh dear. I think actually cutting that wire here has made it even more tricky. So I basically mucked one bit up for myself. So yeah. I screamed at opposable arms. Which is something I guess I took for granted in well made things. But... Schleich have done them very well, but once again, with my experience in the cow barn figure, his paint is gradually coming off when you do the opposable arms. I'm, wa I'm wondering what you guys think. Do you, Would you rather want opposable arms or better paint? Or paint that is guaranteed not to scrape off because i the paint doesn't feel any different if i'm honest the plastic feels different it feels like the plastic they use for the old figures as in the 2006 strike animal figures which i only have about three of because i started collecting in 2012 i believe so i i, I want to see what you guys think if any of you are massive fans and if you've noticed this or haven't had the chance to get a figure, but I'm going to shut up now because we're nearly there. You can't see, but oh my gosh, we're nearly there. I could probably... Now, this figure... <laughs> Oops. Oopsie. We just... <laughs> the horse hates this video already. The horse hates it's you home. That's what it is. You just hate this home, don't you? You really do. I'm not surprised though, you, you're out of the sea, I can understand, and I see glitter, I already see glitter, and there, 
we are look at this beauty oh my gosh we've still got to untouch her the rider I know sometimes they, they give them names so please forgive me if they have and I haven't said the name but this came in her hand it's very beautiful it's not like something I would buy once again if I can focus at the show camera focus anyway so <laughs> there we are your beautiful shells I will put it down here for now next to the scissors and we're going to try and untangle the rider from the horse from the steed which reminds me are you oh it doesn't matter <laughs> Oh gosh, kids. So basically, I like to be specific in names. If they're a boy, I like to give them a boy's name. But this horse isn't specific. So I think we're going to actually... I actually think he's going to be good as a boy. Because I've got a really good name in mind for the horse. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going with it. So, as you guys know, I am obsessed with Pokemon. And I've got actually a number of horses named after Pokemon characters. Most of them... Friends of Ash. I've even got a wolf cub named Ash, which a lot of people just see as an ordinary name, but to me that's a reference to Pokemon. And there's this gym leader in Pokemon Pearl, Platinum, and Diamond, which I need to finish my walkthrough of actually. Uh, the game is still here, don't worry, and the save file has not been touched. But since I've been busy with everything and I've had a few technical difficulties, Anyway, there's a water type gym leader in there called Crasher or Qu Crash Awake. So I'm going to call this horse Crasher or Crash Awake or maybe even the other way around, Wake or Crash Awake. I really like the name Crasher, but then Wake sounds better. So that will be the horse's name since this is... An uh, underwater horse, as I call it, not a seahorse. That is a different thing. How very dare you insinuate those two are the same things. No, of course not. I'm um, sounding crazy. And this last bit is so tricky. I think we're just going to snip, snip. Snippity, snip. You're free. Ryder, you are free. You better be free. Oh, that reminds me, actually. Don't think this is magnetized the rider and horse. So I think it's just a matter of resting her in the right position. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. This is pure awesomeness. Awesomeness. Yeah, awesome horse. The neighbours are probably wondering what the fudge I'm saying. The neighbours are probably concerned. Now you get a super zoomed in image of the horse as I untangle the owner. Oh my gosh, I'm singing in my own video. This is very concerning. And I'll have to pack up afterwards and get all the cardboard in the recycling, but that's okay. Guys, I'm stupid. How, how could I be this stupid and not real? Ooh. <clears throat> right, okay. First thing to show. She has a possible arm. Not two. But she has a possible one. Look at that. That's so cool. That's awesome. This isn't possible, but it's a little bendy. Now, she feels like she's made of the traditional plastic. Maybe her tail is the new plastic that I've been seeing used. But if you look here, it's nicely painted. And the paint doesn't come off as you move the arm. Which is what happened with my last figure. Okay, it's well painted. A little bit lacking in the back. I, I think... Yes, it's magnetic. I should have known. I should have known. The only thing that's making me laugh is the eyes. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, sorry, the eyes. But this horse is beautiful. I mean, honestly, the detail on it is so magnificent. And I thought the simple colour scheme would 
uh, I wouldn't like that, but I do, and I love the addition of the glitter. It is, I mean, it's gorgeous. This, this is, this has got to be one of my favourite horses, and I love this sea blue. You've got contrasting colours. You've got pink with the purple, but it's not overdone. The hair is beautiful, and I mean, I tried to show you. I think I can do this better here. But the detail on here is really good as well. And I think there's a slight shimmer to it. So I think something has been added to it. But I will do a full review on this. Because there's a lot of animals and sets I need to do reviews on. Because I haven't been active in terms of Shrike for a while. So I will say goodbye. The horse shall say goodbye. <laughs> no, no, that's not how you end a video by falling on the camera. So I'll see you guys next time, hopefully for the like update video where you'll see all the models I've got since last time, which is probably going to be a very long video, so it might be split into parts. But thank you for watching if you've come this far and listening to my crazy antics, and hope you enjoyed this unboxing.